Disclaimer, the information in this video is the HomeFlex recommendation for proper bonding in accordance with NFPA 54 section 7.13. All CSST installations should be conducted by a qualified installer. When installing corrugated stainless steel tubing, or CSST, just like black iron pipe, you must bond the system in accordance with NFPA 54 section 7.13. Proper bonding of CSST may significantly reduce the risk of damage, including fire, that may be caused by electrical arcing to CSST from a lightning strike. Lightning does not have to strike a structure directly to cause damage. Conductive systems, like piping or wiring, can become energized indirectly by a lightning strike. When systems are not properly bonded, the current from an energized line can cause electricity to arc or jump from one system to another and damage the CSST. Proper adherence to the bonding instructions should significantly lower the risk of electrical arcing and related damage to CSST. To properly bond CSST, simply attach the HomeFlex UL467 bonding clamp to either the first fitting of CSST or to the black iron pipe component before the CSST. If this method is chosen, make sure to sand the black iron pipe to bond to bare metal. Then, run the minimum 6 gauge copper wire through the bonding clamp. This wire is then attached to the home's grounding network via the grounding bus bar in the panel box. If you are installing CSST or live in a home where a CSST was installed, check for a bonding clamp on the system. If one is not found, please contact an electrician to inspect the system. Disclaimer: The information in this video is the HomeFlex recommendation for proper bonding in accordance with NFPA 54 section 7.13. All CSST installations should be conducted by a qualified installer.